Is 10 years old, Mateo Ramos is undefeated, winning five boxing matches throughout the nation. I'm Ruby Rivera, your Delano neighborhood reporter. He's been in the ring since the age of six and has no intentions of stopping anytime soon. The other red for representing region number eight, Mateo Ramos. <laughs> I never thought, I just thought that, oh, I'm just going to do this and that and that, but I never thought that I will be able to join the competition team. With four years of experience under his belt, Ramos says he never imagined he would be where he is today. Ramos recently returned from the 2024 Silver Gloves National Tournament, which took place in Kansas City, taking home the crown for the second year in a row. Ramos says preparing for these tournaments was challenging, putting his social life to the side and focusing more on practicing and eating healthy. He, he was always here. He was always working out. He was always active and he always wanted to do more than our average kids did. And the silver gloves is you have kids from all you know over the different regions and experience you know so this year Mateo uh, you know uh, fought on Saturday and came out victoriously like he always does he's just you know I mean I, we call him uh, El Toro because he's just like a little bull he just goes forward and he does not stop both his mentor and his coach say Ramos is fearless and are truly impressed with the progress he's made at such a young age. His mom, Miriam Macero, says he started boxing to get out of his shell, but has seen so much more than just a confidence boost. He was very shy. He's shy. You know, he's more mature. He's more outgoing. He's very respectful. What started off as a simple hobby, Ramos now says has become an important aspect in his life and is looking forward to the next time he gets back in the ring. When I first joined, I fell in love with the sport. What is it about boxing that you love so much? I like when, because uh, I was always moved to moving around and throwing punches a lot. <laughs> Mateo is currently on a roll as he's practicing for the National Junior Olympics, which is going to take place in June in Wichita, Kansas. In Delano, I'm Ruby Rivera, your neighborhood reporter.